This story is about the most peculiar man to ever grace the streets of San Francisco. We're talking about none other than Joshua Norton, the self-proclaimed emperor of the United States and protector of Mexico. Now you might be thinking to yourself, ain't this man just some crazy lunatic? But hold your horses, for the story of Emperor Norton is a strange and wonderful tale, one that will leave you scratching your head and asking yourself, what in tarnation is going on? It all started in 1859, when Norton, once a successful businessman, declared himself Emperor of the United States. At first, folks took it as a joke and paid him no mind, but as time went on, they started to see that this man was dead serious. He printed his own currency, issued proclamations, and even had himself a uniform made fit for a ruler. Emperor Norton would parade through the streets of San Francisco, stopping to chat with folks and hand out his currency, which surprisingly enough, was accepted by merchants and used just like any other coin. He was a fixture in the city and was loved by all who knew him. He was even known to take his official duties quite seriously, issuing imperial edicts calling for the construction of a bridge connecting San Francisco to Oakland and for the abolition of the U.S. Congress, which he deemed corrupt. Now, we know what you're thinking. This man must have been locked up in a lunatic asylum. But nay, the citizens of San Francisco held Emperor Norton in such high regard that they made sure he was treated like royalty. Whenever he dined in a restaurant, the proprietor would cover the bill, and if he was ever arrested, which did happen on occasion, the police would release him with a nod and a wink. In the end, Emperor Norton passed away in 1880, leaving behind a legacy that is still remembered to this day. Some folks say he was a visionary, others say he was a madman, but perhaps he was a little bit of both. He lived life on his own terms and refused to be boxed in by the constraints of society. He was a true American original and a reminder that sometimes the greatest stories are the ones that are the most unexpected. So the next time you're in San Francisco, take a moment to raise a glass and remember the Emperor Norton, the man who ruled over a city with nothing more than his wit, charm, and a whole lot of imagination.